The Nigerian army has established a special stand-in court-martial ahead of the 2019 general elections to the country to decisively deal with its personnel found to be involved in any form of electoral misconduct. This is according to the Chief of Army Staff, Lieutenant General Tukeburu Tai, who further charged army personnel to remain apolitical before, during and after the elections. Arit Efanga reports. This is the stance of the army on all future elections in the country, especially the 2019 general elections. Speaking at the first quarter of the Chief of Army Staff Conference in Abuja, the Chief of Army Staff, Lieutenant General Tuko Buratai, says the army must maintain its neutrality and any personnel interested in being sympathetic or obnubbing with politicians should resign. He warned that any personnel found to have received incentives, knowingly or knowingly, will be investigated and appropriately sanctioned. Bratai says the army is reviewing the conduct of its personnel at various theaters of operations across the country with a view to addressing lapses when noticed. As such, officers and men of the army must remain neutral wherever they are deployed and be guided by stipulated code of conduct and rules of engagement. I have directed for a special standing court martial to be set up in preparation for the coming 2019 elections. I must warn that any Nigerian army personnel found hobnobbing with politicians or being partisan will be investigated and sent to the special standing court martial. I must state clearly that any officer or soldier who wishes to be sympathetic to a political religious or ethnic group should voluntarily retire from the Nigerian army. In his welcome address, Chief of Policy and Planning of the Army says the conference is devoted to the appraisal of activities of the Army within the first quarter of 2018 and planned for the second quarter of the year. He encouraged participants to make invaluable contributions and raise issues that will enhance Army operations across board. This conference is therefore an opportunity for us to appraise our activities in the first quarter of the year and to make preparations towards activities lined up for the second quarter in the Nigerian focus of the event 2018. It will also serve as an avenue to discuss other sundry issues in the Nigerian army towards achieving our collective objectives. Bratai, while eulogizing successes recorded by the Nigerian Army at its various theaters of operations, reminded GOCs that undivided attention must be given to operations across the country as the Army will not relent on its decision to deal with criminals and perpetrators of violent crimes to ensure maximum security. Arit Efanga, Court TV News, Abuja.